All right, hey Cancer, so you guys, I am doing a read to kick off July. This is going to be a It's Not You read, so um, the excuse they gave you as to why you guys can't move forward, um, and then we're gonna clarify what's really going on with this person. So, you're gonna know this is your read by um, how you feel about this person and how you met. So if you don't resonate with that energy, please check your moon rising and Venus placements. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. I do hope you guys will stick around and subscribe. All right, so how you feel about this person? Cancer, you're looking at them with uh, some uh, deep soul soulmate energy four of wands you could actually see a future with this person um so i feel like you feel really good in your heart space about the person that's coming through um the chariot card um here's what i'm gonna say you, the two of swords it, it's it's about trying to it's lifting the veil all right um i kind of feel like right now you're just at this point um where you're not seeing it move forward but you want it to move forward all right um with the two of swords coming through also i kind of feel like you might just be in a little bit more of a disbelief um for whatever reason it was that this person gave you as to why that you guys can't move forward right now i just kind of feel like you feel you know that there's more to the story all right and i feel like the chariot card is is here i feel like it's saying that you're you're ready to move forward no matter what um whether it's with this person or without this person. Um, so I feel like you're just, you, 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 there's more to the story. I feel like that's kind of how you feel about this person. There's more to the story. There's more that you're not seeing and you, you do want clarity. Um, but either way, even if you don't get it, you're willing to move forward. How you met, how you met this person, the high priestess, the strength card, and the six of swords. So basically how you guys met, um, I wanna say that somebody may have been going through something, whether it was you or this person. Um, the six of swords is moving past something kind of chaotic and the strength card is kind of embodying, you know, that courage to move forward. So even if you guys were kind of uh, um, friends at first, you were talking a shoulder to cry on, a shoulder to lean on, whatever, um, I feel like there's much more of a connection here, but I feel like it's kind of just, uh, um, I almost kind of feel like you guys were friends, maybe leaning on each other for support. All right. So for this one right here, I'm, I'm kind of thinking that you, the whole dynamic here, I almost feel is like a friendship, um, conversion into romance quite possibly. But I feel like maybe one person has some more feelings than the other person. And it could be, too, that you look at them as somebody who is a, it's a forbidden or they're looking at you like it's forbidden. I don't think it's because of um, marriage. It could be. But let's just see what's going on. So this person that's on your mind, their energy. They're in the Eight of Pentacles. The, the eight of pentacles energy um i do feel like is wanting to work on their situation the full card all right so here's what i'm going to say this person they want to restart with you um how i i uh, channel the um energy is i i um, meditate with the zodiac and then the energy that they're calling in um so this person's energy right now i do feel is the full card coming through as new beginnings okay and i feel like that is desire with you to work on the connection here um the will of fortune coming through um and the six of pentacles so this person really wants to to balance um, the connection um, you guys, I, I don't feel like you're speaking right now. Um, this person's coming through as wanting to balance the connection. Um, it could be too that if you guys um, kind of got into a little altercation or a tiff or whatever, it could be that this person's just letting uh, fate, you know, kind of uh, guide you guys back together. But I do see that they want uh, they want it balanced. They want it, They want stability right here with this connection. So what did they tell you? Why couldn't they be with you? 
Why didn't they want to be with Cancer? The Eight of Wands coming through. I almost feel like this person is the one dealing with something. Yeah, this person is, is the one that's going through something. Um, and I feel like it could be um, ending a relationship or kind of, you know, going through a breakup or whatever it is. Um, with the Eight of Wands, I almost kind of feel like they're telling you that it, things are moving too fast um, and to take it slow with the Knight of Pentacles, right? Um, the Page of Swords, um, this right here, I almost kind of feel was was is coming like as delayed so it's like almost like you're you're starting to catch feelings for this person this friend or whatever they mean to you um you're starting to catch feelings for them and it's like they tell you this after the fact they're, they're like oh my god it's moving too fast even though you guys could be doing this thing for four or six months a year whatever and it's almost like they're telling you that you're moving too fast on them to take it slow all right but i feel like they've i feel like the page of swords is coming through saying um <laughs> they should have told you that a long time ago, right? What's really going on with this person? What is really going on with this person? Page of Cups. The Two of Cups. And the King of Swords. So um, what I want to say is... <laughs> Okay, I, I do feel like this person is being honest with you, but I don't feel like they've been honest with you about how they feel about you. Um, they look at you as a soulmate, all right? They look at you as a soulmate, but I feel like they know that they're not in the proper energy to take on a relationship right now. They have healing to do. The King of Swords is telling me that um, this person needs to transmute some negative energy from a past relationship. And it's almost like this person knows because they don't want to bring that toxicity into your guys' connection. The Page of Cups coming through is, is I, I feel like it's, it's bringing devotion to the connection with you. This person is being honest and pure with you. Um, I just feel like they're not telling you the um, whole story about how they feel about you. So if you're not if you're not feeling like this person's looking at you romantically or like they want anything to do with you, it's not true. They do. I feel if anything, they've left out a whole bunch of feelings that they have for you. So um, how do they feel about you? How do they feel about my friend here, Cancer? How do they feel about Cancer? The Magician card. So they look at you. Um, I got to tell you, the High Priestess and the uh, f the Magician showing up is Divine Counterparts, okay? Uh, divine Feminine and Masculine Energy. Justice card coming through as Balance. And the Queen of Wands is a depiction of them being very, very attracted to you. Um, how do they feel about you? They can see you guys go in the distance, all right? And the Magician card tells me that they are trying to reconnect or pray or manifest this connection um, back to wholeness, all right? Because they're kind of feeling maybe it, they may have said something too soon that, that maybe they shouldn't have had. I almost kind of feel like with what this person told you that you're moving too fast, it could have made you pull back your energy. And I feel like they probably regret the manner in which they um, told you. So what does the next 30 days look like for cancer? The next 30 days you got, so this is going to be at the end of the 30 days, the hanging man coming through. It says there is going to be, um, it's going to go to the end of the 30 days or a little bit past, but uh, this connection is going to come back around with the three of wands. Um, and you guys are, are, the ships are coming in, you know, with that wind. So there's going to be a victory in this connection. The ace of wands as a depiction of um, a new beginning, new start. So, what is the advice? The advice for friend cancer. Yeah, the sun card. This is far from over, you guys, just so you know. The queen of pentacles. So I feel like the, the best advice right here is you guys have a connection that's pretty strong. 
All right, the Seven of Cups I do feel is a depiction of having a, a lot of opportunities, um, growing together, all right, um, just having patience too. Um, I feel your angels and spirit guides through this uh, Queen of Pentacles right here is just saying to focus on yourself. Continue to focus on yourself right now and just uh, transmute any, even any neg negative energy from this connection. It's coming back around you guys. So just, and I don't feel like you're particularly bitter. I feel like you can see this going somewhere pretty far, um, but I feel like patience is going to be key right here. So um, I do feel like this person is going to reach out to you. I don't feel like you're going to have to to put any effort in, especially if they were the ones that were like, oh, you're moving too fast. You know, the sun card showing up here saying that this, ha this, um, this is going to be a very fruitful outcome. It's going to go the way that you want. Um, so even if you just want the apology and to move forward, I feel like that's going to happen. But I do feel like you guys want a little more of this connection um, to come through here, to shine right here on you guys. Um, more of the romantic um, side of things. So you guys, I'm going to leave it here. This is a pretty positive read. Um, if you resonate with this, I would just ask that you maybe like the video so that it cycles um, YouTube and other people that are going through the same thing um, can see the messages that are coming through. So um, I think I'm going to leave it here, guys. I, I, I'm not going to pull initials for this one, but overall, I'll have some new work put out this week for you guys. So you guys take care.